hello welcome once again to my channel in this video i'll show you how you make a cross steel ghana a cross steel super slimy a cross steel exactly what you see on the screen watch a nigerian cook make ghana a cross steel don't go away keep watching and you are highly welcome to my channel let's dive into it so in this recipe i'll be using freshly smoked cod fish you could use any fish of your choice but i choose to use cod fish so i'll go ahead and wash this i'm removing all those whiskers on cod fish because i don't like them then after that i opened it's a bit to take off the sheet because i do not want to eat that in this yummy slimy okra soup man this soup was super delicious everyone and i said let me share with you my friends and families so i added a little salt to the water and after washing it the first round second round it's ready then my second ingredient is bomo or cow skin i'll be using just one round one so this is how i wash my bomo i take knife to scrape the skin a bit and then also the inside sometimes i use iron sponge but in this video i'm using a knife to scrape inside to make sure there is no sound or any dent inside hello all my genius subscriber thank you so much for your wonderful support and if you're new you are highly welcome if you are returning thanks for returning back so after washing the bomo i go ahead and dice it round i love it round dice yours according to how you like it yeah this is it after that so after that i'll place my pot on fire then add my catfish and momo and then freshly chopped onions seasoning all the ingredients will be at the description box down below salt to taste and then i will go ahead and add butter and cover it to simmer on a low flame for um 10 minutes after 10 minutes I will use a spoon to turn it gently or a turning stick and then continue cooking. Don't go away. Keep watching and see how I make that slimy okra stew you saw earlier. It was super delicious. It goes very well with fufu. So I allow it to cook again for 10 minutes. So why that is aside, here I have my fresh okra. So I will be cutting this okra into round shape keep watching and see how i turn this okra after cutting it into a round shape to a slimy okra soup extremely extreme slimy okra soup everyone keep watching don't go away and don't forget to thumbs up so after cutting it the next thing i do is to transfer it to a clean blender Keep watching because after blending, that is not where it ends. We keep on cooking. So I added a bit of water so it does not give the blender some difficulty. So blend it smooth but not over smooth. So it is blended and the next thing I transferred it into a clean pot. And Take it to a fire and add a bit of water and salt and allow it to cook. So while that is aside, here is my fresh tomato and scotch bonnet pepper. I love scotch bonnet pepper, so I will add according to my taste. Please do add according to your taste. So I'm going to be adding onions on to this um, tomato. Some would like to just cut this and use it like that but i after cutting it is going to blend it so why i'm cutting it open into two parts is to make sure there is no some insect stuck in between yeah this is very fresh so 
after washing it, I'm going to be taking it to blend everyone. For more yummy recipes on this channel, please, the links are all down below. And so I'll be adding a half thumb of ginger. This ginger gives this soup a very nice flavor. In fact, it was beyond my test super delicious that i said i must share this ghanaian okra stew watch how nigeria make ghanaian okra stew everyone i love it i i ate this twice in a day and i've not stopped eating i love it it was super delicious with fufu it goes very well with fufu everyone i mean not fufu fufu <laughs> All right, so if you're new, please don't forget to hit the subscription button and turn the bell for notification, everyone. So after blending, I'll just go ahead and add it to my fish. I do not want to fry it for health reasons, so I added my crayfish. But if you love to fry, go ahead and fry it like you make stew. Then I add some bread oil and cover to cook for 20 minutes. And after 20 minutes, this is what the stew looks like, man. At this point, I felt like, oh, let me not add okra again. Let me just um, boil some rice to go with because the stew was super delicious already. So here I have my um, okra. It's still cooking. You have to cook it to um, cook properly before adding it to your um your stew hello everyone you notice in this video i did not add any other um stuff to make the okra slimy it's just super slimy on its own you don't need to add obono or any some some sort of spice no this is natural wow you can see that it is super slimy everyone let me know at the comments comment section down below what you think about this delicious recipe so this slimy okra soup can go with um fufu iba samovita of any swallow of your choice the choice is yours don't forget to subscribe don't forget to thumbs up for me and share my video for if you have the ability to do so all the ingredients will be at the description box down below i noticed i did not add much stock like assorted i just decided to use only fish and mama feel free to use stock your soup with all edibles all meat you would like to say all right thanks so much any subscriber stay safe stay connected see you in the next video everyone and um, bye for now